T minus 10. Five, four, three, two, one. We have engine ignition. Main engine start. And we have liftoff up and carry for the NG-15 mission, the Wallace Flight Facility. Engines are at 100%. Attitude, core pressures, and vehicle subsystems are nominal. The SS Katherine Johnson takes flight on this, the 59th anniversary of John Glenn's Mercury flight, carrying 8,000 pounds of cargo to the International Space Station. Good performance on the first stage so far. Engines at 100%, all systems nominal. Stage one continues, nominal performance, engines at 100%, good, good core pressures. Engines remain steady, added to nominal. Max Q, added to nominal. First stage passing through the area of maximum dynamic pressure on the rocket. 90 seconds into the flight. This first stage burns for a little over three minutes, three minutes, 18 seconds until main engine cutoff. About 90 seconds to stage one burnout. Attitude nominal. Engines at 100% and steady. T plus two minutes. All subsystems continue in nominal performance. All systems, subsystems are nominal. Uh, we'll be ready to shift down to 80% uh, on the engines at 170. Start up slow throttle down. Throttling down at three minutes into the flight, main engine cutoff coming soon. Throttle down to 55%. Main engine cutoff. We have Miko, and Terry's entering into a coast stage. Fairing separation will occur about 30 seconds later. As we lose sight of the vehicle, now switching to animation. Some controlled firings uh, on the interstage of the rocket. Attitude nominal, good separation. Twenty seconds to stage two ignition. All subsystems nominal. Fairing separation. Interstage separation. Confirmed fairing separation and interstage. Stage two ignition. Stage two ignition confirmed. Stage two is a solid rocket motor burns for about two minutes, 44 seconds.